G'day guys, what's cracking? Two Aussie here again. So I'm at KFC and I'm heading in to get the KFC one box. So this thing's $13.45, bit of a pricey one. I'm not too impressed with that, but I do want to try it. So it's got um, about 10 things in it. It's got a piece of original recipe. It's got a wicked wing, uh, original tender, snack popcorn, original fillet piece, portion of chips, regular potato and gravy, dinner roll, one dipping sauce now it comes up with supercharged, but you can change that. I might go with barbecue, I think, and uh, regular drink. So, guys, let's go and try it. Let's see what's all about. Ten different things in there. Should be good, but not impressed with the price. So, guys, not much has happened at KFC. I mean, they bought out. I think yesterday, five dollars in a burger, which is normally five dollar ninety five. Big whoop. So. <laughs> Hopefully they'll come up with something uh, a bit better soon. But for now, we're trying out this KFC one box because I know you guys love it. And don't forget to subscribe and give it a thumbs up if you like the video. I'll get in there and grab this thing and get back to you shortly. Hi, what can I get for you? Hi, can I just pick up order 8406, please? Yeah, for 2A, yep. and you want uh, a regular one box for the taxi? Yeah, thanks. Alright, thanks. Thank you. Thank you. Your two biggest fans are here, man. <laughs> Good to see. Why long, bro? Thank you. <laughs> what a surprise. <laughs> We've subscribed to your TikTok as well, we love it. <laughs> Thanks. Any, any idea when's going to be any new secret menu coming up? Uh, no idea, man. We don't take control of that, but when we find out, we'll let you know. Thanks. People keep asking me. Care, they man. want it badly. <laughs> Thanks, guys. See ya. And here it is. The one box. So we've got the box. Got the drinks. The fellas did all right today. They gave me my serviette and everything, which is good. So... Let's open it up and check it out now. Got the tray out. We'll chuck everything on the tray and see what it all looks like. Let's hope everything's in there because I did see someone else do a little video on this and something was missing. So that wasn't very good for the price. It's looking good so far. I don't know if you can see in there guys. Looks like everything's in there. This is the thing I mostly wanted to make sure it was there. The little snack popcorn. I love that stuff. Okay, so let's get it all out on the tray. Get our popcorn chicken. Looks like everything's in there. Bread roll. We might make a little something up with that. Looks like a wicked wing. Piece of original recipe, not the biggest, but I think that's original recipe quail. Original fillet, tender, potato and gravy, chuck it there. And like I said I was going with barbecue, which I did. Comes up with supercharged, but you can change that if you want. And a portion of chips and some. Let's get them out. There we go. And our drink. I'm not too impressed with this for the price. It's okay. And as usual, when you put everything out on the tray like this, which I've done a few times now, it does look a bit more, but still nothing special. $13.45 only thing that saves it probably get a drink with it that's a good thing but anyway although saying that I haven't popped these out yet have I so let's put these in here now it's looking a bit better put them there it's all, all your stuff chicken shrunk a little bit this time that's a 
the original fillet so what I might do is well <laughs> even they've gotten smaller haven't they look at the size of that damn anyway already for value I'm going to give this three and a half out of five I think for $13.45 you should get a bit more than that forgot to have a chip let's have a chip so I think what I'll do here is get this miniature bread roll <laughs> you know they're I think about 95 cents now or 90 cents just for that so that needs to be a little bit better than that KFC let's put a few chips on there now of course without even eating this for taste of course you're going to give it four and a half or five out of five actually I'm going to give it five out of five we all know how good this stuff tastes the only problem is the value on this one Partly what's actually stopped me from doing this so far. You'd think that would fit on there, but it doesn't. It's too big. So that's your original fillet. Like I said, quite small. Could be bigger. Just break that up. Chuck it on there. I'm not even going to be able to close that because that thing's so small. So not very eats by a KFC. Get that on there, put a little bit of sauce. That should taste alright. Now it's probably better off. If I get that bun and break it, and that's our little chip and fillet burger. Sort of. A <laughs> roll, whatever you want to call it. Do like that barbecue sauce smoky flavor you can even smell it it's so smoky it's i like it it's tops so i know a lot of people like the supercharged and that's the one that comes up probably why that's why because people do like it so much it's pretty popular but i'm trying to keep off the spices a bit at the moment too much of this preservatives and spices and things starts to get to you after a while and the barbecue I actually quite like that for something different now I know that if you went in and bought all these things separately well tell them you can't you can't go in and buy one tender you can buy one fillet you can buy a snack popcorn buy a portion of chips but I know if you went in and bought them all separately, it would cost you a lot more than $13.45. But I think when you get a box meal like this, they're starting to get a little bit pricey. So, for value, I'm not really that impressed. It does taste good, of course. What I will say though is, I will be very full after I eat this. <laughs> so, in that regard, it's pretty good. It's going to fill me up, but plenty of other things I could buy for $13.45 that'll fill me up too, or less. I probably should have opened that before I started because now I've got barbecue sauce all over me. I could have put it there, couldn't I? So I gotta tell you, I wasn't really in the mood for this today. Today I felt like, you know, I just didn't want to get moving, didn't want to get anything done. I've been sort of stalling on this one too. But those guys in the drive-thru, <laughs> my two biggest fans, they cheered me up, they made my day. So now we're all good and ready to go again. That is pretty good. Tastes pretty good, that Philip. So, I'm going to have a little bit of potato and gravy. And this is a regular one. Now, when I said there was 10 different things in there, one of them was actually the dipping sauce. So, so I count it as a separate thing because it is, it is actually a thing. It's part of it. It is good you can get a dipping sauce. That's nice and hot. That must have been just made fresh. 
that's actually probably the best one I've ever had. So nice and hot. Beautiful. Let's try the tender with the dipping sauce. That's your tender. Decent sized tender. Totally each way. Loving it. Got a bit of spill a bit of sauce. The chips are just as usual, average KFC chips, nothing special, but they're alright. That's so good, I can't help eating it. Let's eat some popcorn chicken. Popcorn! <laughs> so, Richard Wing. Very crunchy. You can probably hear that. That was like a bit of a change up, wicked wing. Nice and spicy. And that's what I was saying. I went with the barbecue, not the supercharged because we've got spice here. None of some of these things, like the gravy's going to be have some sort of preservatives in it and other things. And like I said, it starts to get you after a while. But, everything in moderation. You know, there's one thing I've never, I don't think I've ever tried. <laughs> Chips with barbecue sauce. Well, I probably have. That's actually pretty good, but I do love this sauce, it's fantastic. Read up all the chips because they're getting cold. I like that. Good stuff, try it out, guys. Barbecue sauce on chips. I'm sure most of you have tried that before. <laughs> so there's not much left here guys. I might finish it up here. So if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. And remember, you can never be too Aussie. Hooroo! I'll chuck a few of these. I'll chuck a few of these in here. There you go. I've done that before. They taste pretty good like that.